Welcome to Google Day 2. Now most of you had a pretty good start yesterday. I saw some really creative ideas. Um, but what we need to do next is work on execution. And I blame the really bad coloring on your classroom teachers. Um, and I think that's mostly because if you're doing a you know an assignment on um, Abraham Lincoln and she asked you to draw a picture, you'd draw it really fast and kind of, you know, get it colored in and teachers check it off and say, okay. But in our class, we expect a little bit more, uh, you know, on the coloring. And as much as I, I respect our teachers for teaching you about, uh, you know, Abraham Lincoln and those important things, when it comes to coloring, uh, I just expect a little bit more than maybe the classroom teachers do. And what, what I mean by that is, uh, and I went ahead and, and this is my still life drawing. I've shown it to some of you before. Uh, but what makes this an A? Well, I'll tell you. There are different color. Um, I got like orange and red in here. I've got some light and dark. I pushed in the background. I have some light colors. I have some texture on here. All of those things are things I expect to see in an A plus drawing. B, I get this a lot, and I'm, I'm, I'm happy with this, but I, I think you could do better. Um, you know, this everything is kind of flat. It's all kind of the same hardness. I got a little darker over there, which is actually more like an A, a drawing. But everything is the same. It's nice colors. It's colored in. It's inside the, the lines. Got a black outline around it. Um, not bad. I give that a B. C is just kind of scribbly. If I can see your pencil marks... Um, I can't give that better than a C. It looks like the person needed to sharpen their pencils here. And then, of course, lastly, um, not in, the colors don't even make sense. Um, and that, I'd give a D. Um, and so I, I, we'll have this out. So if you want to sure, if you say, I'm done, uh, you might check it against that. Where are you? In a, maybe some of you people who draw like a C drawing, you could push yourself to a B or B, push yourself for an A. Um, let me show you some excellent examples of some creative designs that I've had over the year for Google. Um, this is Halo, the video game, and you got Master Chief right here. That's that L is that weapon that always my son kills me with. Uh, you know, very creative idea. Um, here's one, uh, another video game inspired one. A little harder to see the G O O G L E, but it's there. It's it's really, I mean, that's really amazing. That was a fifth grader who did that. The more I look at that, that looks very professional. Um, this one's fun, and when we talk about coloring it in. Um, this person wasn't particularly one of my best drawers. My, my best be able to draw, just draw what you want, but what a clever idea. Um, she really uh, shaded that those in and got the most out of the color pencil. Um, same with this one too, I should say. We got lights and we got darks here. A plus kind of like the red. You can't even tell that's a color pencil. Same with this. It's very hard. I mean, you get really close, we can see the scribble marks, but pretty much, uh, uh, and what a great idea. Two eyes and, and Google's watching you. Um, little conspiracy theory here. This is one of my first years that I did the Google assignment, and I, just, I thought the, the um, uh, Art supplies was really interesting. Once again, this isn't, you know, blow you out of the water kind of creative uh, idea. It's just St. Patrick's Day with some four-leaf cl clovers. You can't get any more, really more simple with the idea. But look at that coloring. We got dark and got the most out of those colors, and it's really clear to see. Um, excellent job. I love, look at the detail in, in this, in the moon right there, and I don't know what that ghosty thing is and the letters coming up, but just an excellent example. Um, here's one of my students. I'll be honest with you. This is not someone I would have thought would have an A-plus drawing on them, uh, but when he came up with this, it just looks great, very creative. Um, yeah, it's, it's pretty simple house, pretty simple taxi there, but it looks like an E, and it just it, you could tell the kid had fun. And, uh, and that's the way I want it for you guys, just have fun. Get the most out of your crayon. Let's not get any of that scribbling stuff out, uh, out of the way. Um, use your, your crayons the best you can. If you need to restart or start a whole new idea, I'd rather see three new restarts um, than trying to overwork something that's really bad. Uh, so sometimes it's okay to uh, save those. If you mess up, save them, put them in your art box, and when I go to grade, I'd like to see everything you did and maybe see your learning process. So... Um, really push yourself today, get some nice colors, um, and we'll do good.